Right, we're here with Roman Puglisi, defensive midi for University of Maryland. We got to start off with your game-winning goal. All right, it's you know some guys were remembered for that. You'll always be remembered for that. Tell us how that play developed against Penn, right? Correct. Um, it was just we were struggling at the X all day, and Austin came in, uh, scrummed it up for us. Brozo had a, a great ground ball, and was lucky enough to be open in the middle of the field and, and able to hit it. I mean, it's something that, that you dream of as a young kid. Uh, but I mean, that's all the credit to my teammates that saved Danny made at the, at the end of the at the end of the game to, to get us into overtime. I mean, that was incredible. So um, it's really just a culmination of the whole game, all my teammates. I mean, it wasn't just about me, but it's definitely something you dream of as a kid. And to have it come true, um, it was pretty incredible feeling. Last year for the Terps, that uh, defensive midi was a tough position. It showed up against Duke. Uh, what was your, you know, what was the teachings to you during the off season? Was yeah. there anything different? Um, I think, you know, just being fortunate enough to play last year as a freshman was pretty incredible. Um, obviously, the film shows there was a lot of growing pains and, and a lot going on there. My head was spinning a lot, but just investing the time. Um, I had great senior leaders that, that took after me last year. I, I give a lot of credit to Bryce, Bryce Young and Adam DeMillo for really uh, bringing me along and teaching me a lot and then just going into the offseason I, I knew that I needed to be better We needed to be better as a unit and it was it was something the coaches talked about a lot So just just putting your head down and, and swallowing your pride and going to work over the summer and in the offseason trying to get better every day um, You know, we added Mike and Alex who have who've been tremendous for us um, and, and us four with Tom as a group we've, we've developed a lot and we've developed a lot of chemistry and it's it's not about who's on the field or who's playing together. It's just about making each other better every day, and that's kind of the mentality we've took. Talk is brought to you by Viner Four Gates Consulting. Call Viner Four Gates for all of your IT needs. In the D.C. Baltimore area, you could reach us at 301-251-2900 or on the web at www.vinerfourgates.com. Uh, where'd you go to high school, uh, Roman? Paul the Six. Holy Six? Paul the Six. Paul the Six. Correct. That's in Virginia? Correct. All right. What made you come to Maryland? Where else are you looking at? Uh, I want to stay close to home, so um, it, it was a pretty easy choice. Uh, kind of came down to here, Hopkins and, and UVA for me, all, all very close, but just fell in love with the school, um, having the opportunity to play for Coach Tillman, uh, once in a lifetime experience, and, and just, just knowing the guys and, and the love and the passion that everyone around the state of Maryland has for Maryland lacrosse, it, it was something I couldn't pass up. How excited are you for this weekend? You're facing one of the best offenses in the nation. Yeah, uh, it's going to be a great test. Um, I think everyone on our defensive end uh, is super excited. Um, we can't wait to get after it. Number one offense in the country coming into our house. I mean, it, it's going to be pretty incredible. But uh, we prepare the same way every week, and, and we, we have the people in place and a game plan that Coach Jesse puts together. So, um, you know, whatever we have to do, we're going to do it. We're going to sell out for our, each other, and, and we're going to make the most of it. It's going to be a great environment, and it's going to be a fun night. And what's it like to have this guy behind me, Curtis Corley, is like, one of the leaders on the defense. Yeah, uh, his, his passion for lacrosse and his, his passion for, for us as teammates, um, it's been incredible. I mean, since the moment I stepped on campus, you could see why he's so good on the field and, and just the love he has for everyone, the love he has for lacrosse. Uh, the excitement and passion he has. Um, it's pretty incredible. And, and being able to play with one of the best defensemen in the country every day, um, you pick up little things that, that you wouldn't necessarily pick up if, if you weren't around him. So you, you learn something new every day. And his leadership, uh, his style of leadership is incredible. And, and, and he makes us all better just being on the field with him. Roman, good luck the rest of the year, buddy. Thank you, sir.